All right, I'm going to be here One Ghana TV. I'm saying for you, I'm going to host some more SC actress Beverly Afaglo. Ne dying as she ni be bia busiya for e ya rehosem ne bags ne wigs ne be bia as she. Ne kwa ya e fast wa e si ya no wache chum onu anka sakura na onifi na rehosem wa e wamu ni se fire service for mu juho on time. Ne so mu juho on over forty minutes no mu tini enye she. Ne busiya mani mu tu uka akwe gina hose mu kodum no na mu kodum ni se ya nkoni ya nkoti Beverly onu ani masi mu Emra. I live with my mom. My mom has garden at the back of the house so i mean a woman who is almost 80 she's always bored she wants to do gardening stuff so she always goes to her farm that's what she calls it every morning so apparently she went to do her regular farming and she gathered some weed weeds and she bent it so according to where the 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 fire had gone down and she left and she went to relax. So my house help made lunch and went to give her her food. So when she was going back to my side of the apartment, then she could perceive smoke. So she went through the corridor and um, she realized that the smoke is coming from the back. So my room faces the back itself. So she said she went to open my door and the room, the the smoke had engulfed the whole room. So she shuddered back and quickly ran to grandma's place and said, Grandma, are you burning something at the back of the house? And she said, eh, me doom no, eh, de asem. So they, both of them walked to the back of the house and saw that fire was raising the whole place. By then, uh, my cousin had gone to pick um, my first daughter from school. So he got back and came to meet the fire and um, they went to open the polytank and my cousin and my household started pouring water on the fire so when they were pouring water the smoke was coming so they decided that they should take grandma and the kids out of the house so they took grandma and the kids out and drove the two cars out of the house and when they tried coming back to save whatever the smoke had engulfed the whole house so they started calling fire service so I was in town in Tema, all right, not too far. Then um, a neighbor called me that, um, um, Beverly, your house is on fire. There was so much traffic from where I was going. I had to pack my car, jumped on Okada and quickly get to my house. When I got there, by God's grace, fire service was there, all right. But over 40 minutes, they didn't know what to do. They said the smoke is too much, so they can't enter. They didn't know what I to do, says I. They the smoke is too much they can't enter and i'm like don't you have protective gears don't you have a plan what can you do we were just screaming now people were like they don't have water and they said no we have water but the smoke the smoke the second car came now that second car also came and was trying to give this one water and eh, was trying to start a generator that wouldn't start in 15 minutes they will start it and it will go off. They will start it and it will go off. Then a third car came. Then they didn't know what to do. Then people, the neighbors around, everybody had gathered in front of the street. And they now told them that they should go to the back of the house. The neighbor that I share a wall with, they should go there and go into their house and now start pouring water. That was how they started quenching the fire. And I'm thinking... Don't you have plans? Aren't you equipped? Don't you know how to how to deal with these things? Fire comes with smoke for crying out loud. How can you tell me because the smoke you can't get your holes in there or like oh goodness. I was just standing there and crying because everything was going. Everything. I couldn't take anything, not even my passport, nothing. How I went out in my slippers. It wasn't like I was even going out for a function that I would say I was stressed. I was just wearing a t-shirt and leggings and a handbag, sunglasses, my face mask, nothing. That was all. And everything was gone. My kids were saved by God's grace and that's all. 
Nobody has anything. Okay, I'm saying for Beverly, I'm going to say, I'm going to say, I'm going to say, and you will say Beverly sent your foot to a bank and what they be quite ma a year if you are safe and then no say a dear way dear won't mean to be a fool because a sign a bit me a tool be a now fire service for now would not you know someone fix them on your may ye because fire service they just to be a bit more body a dear tea be a smoke and we see a bit free waba and to banana cause a moose any or too much it's only me quite anymore as a not a hard drink a crack and then maybe a whole more my Ghana a Beverly neck and say any idea the anti any politics seminal which advice would you give? I, I know it's quite a, a, a tra traumatic situation for you. How, how would you advise listeners or people who may be in this kind of situation? Uh, my major advice is really not for people who find themselves in this situation because really these things happen without you knowing. There's no plan, nothing. Even if you have a fire extinguisher, who knows where it will be hidden and where the fire will start from. So really, uh, my advice to not even go for anybody per se, but to fire service. Because as I said, fire service was there on time. But what's the sense in coming on time when you are not well equipped or you can't salvage the situation? At the end of the day, you came and the house still got burnt down. So... Is, is it just about coming to make a report? So this country, eh, we should we should prioritize certain things and stop doing the misplaced priorities. Like some things that are not important, we should put it aside and deal with the most important things. Until it happens to you, we see it so far. When, oh, Makola asks you and we feel like, oh, but until it happens to you, you will never understand the situation, the gravity of how it feels. We should all talk about these things. We've been talking about fire service. It's not today. If they need to go for training, they should go. If they need to be equipped with things, they should go. How can fire service come with a generator that cannot start? How can, how can a team come? That when they get there, they don't know where to go, what to do, how to start it. They don't know what to do. Over 40 minutes, Andy, they were standing there because they said the smoke is too much. They can't go inside. I literally ran inside to see, but I couldn't see anything. The truth is the smoke was too much. Yes, all right. But are you telling me you don't know fire comes with smoke, that there should be a plan? I couldn't see anything. The whole place was white. I couldn't see anything. The whole compound was white, so you can't even go inside it. Yes, but what is the plan? If we say there is a, a, an institution called fire service, then they should learn how these things are done. What is done? What do they use? Because at first they say they don't have water. That's what the stories we've been hearing. These people came with water. So they should be they should be trained if their equipment or they uh, their their um things they have to wear something to know how to deal with these things like for instance if they've gone under training they know how our houses are built they know that you you don't even have access to uh, certain places so in such situations what's the best thing to do it was the lame man standing there that said, this third car has come and this third car can also literally do nothing. Go to the back of the house, enter somebody's house and start quenching the fire from the back of the building because that's where the fire is coming from. Before they say, okay, then they moved. Like you don't know that this is what you're supposed to do. Hmm. Beverly, please take heart. I know it's a very difficult situation that no one would want to be in. Um, so, how do we help? Really, I don't know. I don't even have panty to wear. <laughs> so, oh. I don't know. Anything is welcome. Anything is welcome. I need to start building again. I need to get a place to stay. I'm staying at my sister's house. Yes, we all have rooms here. I'm comfortable. But, there is nothing like you having your own place that kids can have their own space and you can change the TV channel as and when you want and you know, that kind of thing. So, I mean, we are here. 
uh, one where, year. Where, where, where is your husband, please? My husband is in America. How long so has he been? My husband doesn't live with us. Yes, he doesn't oh, okay. live with us anymore. So, what does it mean he has relocated to America? Yes, he has relocated. Yes. Wow. Hmm. It's a very unfortunate situation. Okay, I'm saying for Beverly, any akuti na areho, areho. Now they be say they are mad, quiet, and just a man can hear one. So, come so cranny here. Aye. Prior honey ho ewa America, just a areho. Now we see on areho sempa esawo. Any man what on town no? A big crowd will feel. We no ni as semono. Yes, and Kawa Shrifi, the Anukan and Kaganema or Tonton and Sora, and so I said Fana will feed one for pin, one for Biba Kra. I really hope I'm saying Kony Kotibimla. When I was coming back, I was coming back from the Michelle Camp Road. As far as a shaman ran about, I could see the smoke coming. Really? I was sitting, I was sitting on Okada and I was crying because I'm like, is this coming from my house? Because it's crazy. Have okay. So, have you been given any reports by by the fire service as yeah, to what, what could have what, what could have? Was there. Fire service was there. ECG came to switch power off because the way fire service couldn't treat the situation, we had to call ECG to come and switch the whole community off and see whatever the situation is, so that it doesn't escalate to something else. So everybody was there. Nadmo has been there. They've done their reports and. Okay, so what what was the report saying? Do they suspect arson, or was it by that uh, that little? I don't uh, know. At least they asked what what happened, and we told them that we are suspecting the bush that my mom was burning, probably um, the wind because it was quite windy yesterday. Maybe the wind just sparked the fire again, and it started it. That's what we are suspecting. But they said they are coming back today to check in. I don't know. So everything is down, like it's empty. It's an empty house. The building is down, everything. So when the where, moment the roof went off, everything was just raising down. Hmm. So where did you spend the night? Um, I mean my sister's house. We are all here. To children? My children, my mom, yeah. Hmm. Were there valuables in there? Oh, of course a lot. A lot of valuables. I I can't quantify. Like a lot of valuables. A lot, a lot. I, I even even feel sorry for my mom for her lifetime memories in the like you know um, grandparents our mothers they love to carry stuff like that. So they have their old photos of when they got married to my father when they did this, when they did that. She has a full room of clothes, only in Tuma, in the room. My place, <laughs> Andy, you don't want to see even how long my shoe rack is. Talk less of my walk-in closet, my, my perfumes on my table, like numbers, what, what. My things that I sell, sometimes I stock some in my house. It's not everything that goes to the shop. I have wish trainers. I have coffee, slimming coffee, slimming pills in my room, in boxes. If my house help had even called me that this is happening, I would have said, carry this out for me. At least these are things I sell. Like, nothing. Everything is gone. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to say, I'm Beverly, I'm going to say, Asama atoni ya diabe tuja na Fire service for no na asa nansa ino Ya ya bo mudi ndo do Eja to bebi ya no mo kwa E nsuo ne eni ho E nsuo su ni ho a ni espake janueta ya nyeso E na se yi ti ase E ya do su niti ya be siremo Se eni ya mebi ni eni ho na se mo be kachira banya ma na fexi ya mamua E no be ya be ta se eni ya ma be jense mo Mi pacha on so fo wa jen chire e bra subscribe To one gana tv ne like ye videos Tap tap send e ye mobile money appa Ya di send this car from Europe to Ghana if I just say a bank account, say a mumbo, only problem. You hear, and it's our bed download the tap tap send our phone. So now download the process. Nimi we use our promo code. Me patch up one Ghana tap tap send the force over one Ghana on better five pounds, five euros free. Only manage some of it. 
Why we are now send this kind of charges be any? I will say I won't pay and I'll pay again. But my day, not download the tap tap sent na a bad boy in you Samsung has a four against man capsule says, Say, yeah, a man may born in some running full nente. Or monoma with me, you know, mona so boy, you may ye. Ain't he bear my wash me, but my day, no copebino. A sick of four gentleman capsules. Now, so with my boy, you man, what you know, now so. Samsung and TSC capsules are by my and ma, and you may tell him, my boy, become my hip, you are a crudging sabre or virgin. O menstruate, Nasa Ote Yawa Bomode, Nakope and TSC capsules, no, Ningina Ebeko. Midi Ede Ama, Pokia, Nominitaba.